name is Lindsay Lombard. I live in South East London and I'm a freelance illustrator. This project is important to me. I think it's a great way of showcasing new emerging talent. I think there's such a quality to being able to view it in front of you in print rather than just as pixels on a screen. I look forward to seeing the other work submitted in the final publication. I'm Lyle Grant and I'm an illustrator and printmaker currently working between Norwich and London. I specialise in traditional fine drawing, creating work mainly for publishing and album covers, as well as exhibiting independent print runs. I found this project particularly engaging because of simply what it was asking for, being an artwork with a sense of wonder, folklore and a kind of mystic beauty, all of which I've been trying to encapsulate during my career as an illustrator. Hello, my name is Emma Favarance and I am an illustrator and children's book graphic designer living in London. I'm very excited to be taking part of Amelia's Magazine's 10th year anniversary, Things Which We Do Not Understand. And I'd like to share with you a sneaky peek of my illustration, which is the story of Chang E and the reason why there is a rabbit on the moon. My name is Esse Kimpimaki and I'm a freelance illustrator from Glasgow. I'm originally from Finland, but I've been living here in Scotland for the past seven years. And I've been a fan of Amelia's magazine for a long time, so I think it'll be really exciting to see it back in print. And I'm especially really, really happy and honored to have the chance to be a part of this anniversary edition myself. I'm Dan Daz Einan. I'm an artist and illustrator from South Wales and a recent illustration graduate from Falmouth University. To be given the opportunity to see my work printed in this publication will be absolutely fantastic. Hi, my name's Maya Fjord and I'm an illustrator based in Woking, which is near London. I think this project's a great way to showcase the work of upcoming artists and support the creative community and that's why it's important to me. Ciao, I'm Cristian Grossi and I'm an Italian designer. I live in Sassumaggio Terme, Italy, and I do design for art and fashion projects. But this project is important to me because it gives me the opportunity to make the most of Yugen Steel style that belongs to my land, my story and my town. And I think that this book, this 10 year book, will be a milestone Hello, my name is Laura Wilson. I'm a recently graduated illustrator living in Cardiff in Wales. I would appreciate it so much if you would consider backing this campaign for that which we do not understand, as it would be such an amazing opportunity for me to be involved in this inspiring collection of work. And I'm really excited to see what other amazing creations people have been coming up with. It's going to be such a beautiful, mystical issue, and I really hope you get involved. My name's Gemma Cottrell and I work as a freelance illustrator and designer in Rugate, Surrey. I really wanted to take part in this project as I've always been drawn to material that explores the alternative, especially paganism, as it reveres the female form. Hello, my name is Yoko Furusho. I'm a Japanese illustrator based in New York. This is very personal thing though. My grandfather passed away last year and I started to think about the, what will happen after the life. Japanese people believe the souls will return carried by the cows and horses in August. So I try to draw the scenery of the other side as praying for my grandfather's rest in peace. Hello, I'm Sarah Tanner Jones. I'm an illustrator. Um, I'm going to be taking part in Amelia's Magazine's 10th anniversary edition. Um, the theme is that which we do not understand and we're raising the money to get it made on Kickstarter so please give generously. Um, the work of myself and lots of other illustrators and writers is going to be collected together so I can't wait to get it made. Um, thank you very much for your support. Hello my name is Antonia Parker and I live in Tunbridge Wells. I'm a maker and a lot of that making is the illustration that you can see all around me. Uh, now I wanted to be part of this project because the theme is that which we do not understand um, and I've had two miscarriages previously uh, and I wanted to make some work about the journey that I went on to get to peace with them. I've also worked with Amelia many times before and she produces such lovely work so I know that this book is going to be really stunning. <laughs> 